Okay, so guys, man, uh, no better time than now to talk about the purge, man. Um, we're in America, man, so we're actually experiencing the uh, dopeness that is the American way of life, man. Um, let's talk about the purge, man. The purge ban is uh, based in 2022. Um, unemployment is at 1%. Uh, crime is uh, down at all-time low. And uh, once a year, uh, the United States uh, government approves the what they call annual purge, and that's pretty much where you just go out and uh, <laughs> straight murk cats. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you release your anger and your rage and your frustration and your hatred and everything, um, and pretty much just killing people. There's there's um, uh, 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 the the band is lifted on all violence, including murder. Um, and you can just pretty much do what thou wilt, okay, and um, you won't be punished for it, okay? Um, the uh, movie uh, stars that guy, uh, Ethan Hawke, man. It also stars um, the one and only uh, 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 Sarah uh, uh, Connor, man. So pretty much, let me just tell you this real quick. This movie, The Purge, is before The Terminator, Alright, I'm being dead serious by that. The reason why I said that, man, is because that's what it feels like, man. It has that, 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 I don't know, uh, cybernet type of vibe to it, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, governmental control, but it feels like there's somebody behind it, you know? And, um, I think the best thing about the movie, the, the thing that I really enjoyed the, uh, most about the movie was the ending. The ending of the movie was one of the best endings that I've seen in a very, very long time, man. Um, unfortunately, the movie had a very very um hard time man trying to get through the first um the second and third act man very boring man i almost fell asleep three times on the movie um and yeah it's just it was pretty pretty bad man um but i do recommend going to see it man or if you you know the reason why i say go see it is because if you go see that matinee it's very cheap I don't recommend buying this movie on um, DVD or Blu-ray, um, a digital download. Maybe if it's three ninety-nine, yeah. But this movie is, um, yeah, it's 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 bad, guys. I'm serious, man. It had so much potential, but it's really really bad. Anyway, getting back to the uh, story about what the actual movie is about. Um, this uh, Ethan Hawke's family. I don't know what his name is. I forgot his name. It's really not important. Um, they. Uh, he his company runs the protection for the um, for the houses, and he installs this new security system. Man, right before the in, um, the annual purge, he gives it to his neighbors, and um, um, the the night of the purge, when they go ahead and um, arm their house, man, there's this uh, there's this black dude in the street, man. He's being chased by these um, people with masks, man, and these masked uh, men and women. Um, they're doing the annual purge, and they selected this black dude, man, um, as the, um, uh, let's call it pig for the slaughter, all right, and now um, that's what they refer to him inside of the movie as pig and slaughter and swine, all right, and, um, what ends up happening, man, is that, uh, Ethan Hawke's, uh, son, um, decides, uh, really in an annoying way, man, decides to disarm the, uh, the, uh, security system. Um, I don't, I don't understand why he would have a code, but I mean, whatever, I guess he has a code, maybe he's just intelligent like that or something, or maybe his dad shares the information, but anyway, unlocks the code, man, and that lets the, uh, the black dude in, and then the, uh, um, the people that are chasing the black dude with the mask, they come up to the house, um, and they find out, um, that from, from the neighbors, they go, you know, ask the neighbors, shoot up the, shoot up the neighborhood, you know what I'm saying, and really not injuring anybody, but just giving that threat that, if they don't give up the if they, if they don't give up this black dude then the purge is going to come right on their doorstep and then uh the neighbors end up giving up Ethan Hawke's uh family um and you know kind of let them know hey I, we saw you know um this guy's family you know open up the uh open up the um what you call it you know what I'm saying uh open up their security system and let this black dude in and what ends up happening man is that the black dude um uh, runs in, you know what I'm saying, once the security system opens up, and then, um, he's like, you know, will somebody help me, the, the kid opens up the security system, black dude hops in, and then that's how the movie pretty much, uh, starts, man, and reaches its, uh, climactic point, man, um, and then, uh, they give, uh, Ethan, uh, Hawk's family, man, a, uh, ultimatum, they say, you know, um, release the swine, give us the swine back, or we're going to, uh, purge your house, man, and kill everybody inside, 
and that's when the war starts inside of the house and outside the house and it, it was just bad man um but yeah that's pretty much all the movie is man then something happens at the end i don't want to ruin it but there's a little twist and then the movie ends man so yeah better looks next time but yeah that's about it man hopefully you guys uh enjoy this but uh if not just enjoy the clouds <laughs> oh yeah